I have brought my secateurs. They were in my bag on my back for ages, um, protected inside uh, one of the blue fisherman's rubber gloves that we'd salvaged at some time. Little did I know that uh, we'd been out in a rain or something, the water had got in. Uh, they were very close to being uh, thrown away because of the state of them, but uh, we scraped a bit of the rust off and uh, they're still usable. So, As we wander back in this direction, there are a few offending brambles. We shall be having a bit of a gentle trim. Nothing major, I can assure you. Let's take a wander. What are we going to do? Find a trail of rubbish all through the woods here, are we now? Okay, we uh, trimmed a bit as we went, just a few bits of bramble. And the final job for the secateurs is that. Ew. <laughs> Cubs might be to wash the secateurs there. Right, we're done with them, we shall put them back in our pocket. Just wait a minute, mate. Poop bag's gone. Okay. Oops. Hi there. Oh, I was forgetting that. I was forgetting that. Uh, the bad news is that's not going to fit, is it? Or is it? Just wait, Burr. Ah, oh, Christ. I was forgetting that. Actually, the bin turned out to be pretty much empty, apart from that big green plastic. I bet I know where that's come from. Anyway, we pushed it all down. We have got rid of the rubbish. We have yet another bag. Actually, we made two on that deal, didn't we? I got too many now. It's getting to the point where I'm just going to start chucking them away. Okay. Of uh, my the inside of my pocket, as I just record, I think I didn't get the button right. Put it in my pocket, recording again. Got a hard drive full of that stuff. Okay. I'm hearing them all around. I'm hearing them all around. There's another one off to my left here. I think he might be answering that one or, you know, staking his claim on this territory. Uh, spitting up a seed there as well. He's uh, keeping altitude. Which is a shame, really, because I do actually have some food with me if he so chose. Should we try it? Should we try it? Should we stand here with a hand out? Should we try it? Right, he's right there. So I'm going to get something out of my pocket and see if uh, he, he shows any interest in a change of location. Where's the bear? He's behind me. Right, you just wait, mate. You're going to put him off, aren't you? 
Right, that's the uh, the Tupperware we uh, <laughs> we once found, which uh, we've now employed uh, for a bit of grated cheese. We remembered this morning the cheese is uh, starting to go off. It's uh, cost a fortune. It's still sat there, I'm messing around here. I've got to shut this Tupperware a bit uh, properly. Just hang fire, mate. I've got a little bit in my hand here. All right, let us give this a go. Is he going to show any interest? Uh, the answer appears to be no. I'm going to have a short tolerance for standing here like this. It's just hurting my back. Oh, you've seen it. He's twitching. He's twitching. That's me making a stupid noise. I'm making a complete fool of myself here. <laughs> He's not going to, is he? I'm wasting my time. <laughs> I've had enough already. I didn't give it very long, but uh, I'm going to... Okay, what I've got here, I'm going to leave it on the, the timbers here. He can uh, find it, or the crows will have a good time. What a waste of good cheese. Flipping expensive stuff now. Hand. Where's he gone? Oh, living little devil. Oh well, at least he got the idea. It's not wasted. That's best cheddar cheese, mate. Extra strong. Cost a flipping fortune. Could have had that on toast when I got in. See if you will. Let's uh, pick that back up. See if you'll have a bit more of that. Determined to give it a go. No, you don't want to. You don't want to. I'm chasing him. <laughs> I'm chasing him. Ah, uh, he's not having it. Alright, I'll put it back on the put it back on the log. Perhaps he doesn't like cheddar cheese. Okay. Shot here. The guy's fishing there, fishing from the rocks, but they're surrounded by floating rubbish. They're fishing in the rubbish here. It's just that's rubbish, loads of it floating about right in front of them. They're fishing around the rubbish. Flipping heck. There's loads of it all the way around here. These, what are these? Tickets or what's what is that? There's loads of it. Yeah, I can't make out what that is. There's loads of it all floating about here. Uh, to the chair. It's a bit hazy over there, but we'll have a go for the train nonetheless, because there is a train hooting at us here. Yeah, it's very hazy. There is a big bank of sort of sea mist uh, visible from home when we woke up, or soon after. Right. We're uh, sitting here for a bit, trying to cool off. It's very much cooler here, very much.
Morning. Okay. <laughs> They're uh, full of life, those two. They looked very well trained, actually, we're in the process of. Better than you, Bear. I said before, I, you know, I film whatever we see. I, I, I can't make stuff happen. It's uh, Robin business. It's, it's not showing any flipping interest at all. It's funny when I'm filming the boats and stuff like that. You know, he'll come and end up on the end of the chair. There's a whole pile of cheese here, and he's not bothered. The bear was having a sniff. You, you come around here, mate. There. There we go. <laughs> That's the best way to deal with cheese, isn't it, Burbank? Parcel to a bit of cheese. There's a tiny bit left there, so the robin may, may still have a bit. A couple of little flakes. I think the robins are fed with mealworms and all manner of stuff, aren't they? Delicacies, so uh, yeah, a bit of rotten cheese. They're not going to be first, are they? Yeah, there's none left now. All right, thank you, Bear. <coughs> Yeah, I don't think we'll be uh, wasting any more cheese, thank you. And right on cue, there he's back again somewhere above me. The little devil.